This is when it really gets tense. Only four teams remain in the biggest club competition in the world, and we're not far away from kickoff in the first leg. Stay with us, we'll have all the action for you from Manchester here on EA TV Live. Well, you can certainly feel the excitement tonight here at the Theatre of Dreams, Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray, and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And tonight we've got the semi-final of the Champions League coming up for you. It's Manchester United up against Ajax. Well, this is what the Champions League is all about. Some of the world's best players, two excellent teams and a great stadium. Let's hope we're not disappointed. Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. David De Gea starts in goal. Victor Lindelof plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. And the front pair, Cristiano Ronaldo, starts together with Marcus Rashford. Here's the starting lineup for Ajax. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations, and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. And underway now in this Champions League semi-final first leg. Edson Alvarez. It's with Berghaus. Well, high marks for that pass. Now, let's see what they can do here. They really look after the ball when they have it. I think I spoke too soon. Wasn't the best of passes, finally. Oh, in with a chance! And a goal! The opening statement of the semi-final. How important could that prove to be? Well, we can take another look at how close this was. It was marginally over the line, yes, but no doubt it was a goal. So Ajax restart the game. Well, we're going to find out if there will be a quick reply from them here. There certainly needs to be. Did well to win the ball back. A sloppy pass. Can the owner of the red car registration be jailed for Darren M? Please return to your vehicle. The lights are on. Sebastian Allaire. Masrawi with it. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Well, we can't be too critical. Throw in coming up here. A 
and that was a very fine read Aller it's there for him it's still alive and in at the second time of asking just what was required Well, here it is again, and I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper because he makes a very good save to start with. Where are his defenders following in? It's the attackers that get there first, and it's a very good finish. So back underway, following the equaliser. Diogo Dallo. Harry Maguire now. And there to intervene. Cristiano Ronaldo. Will he play it in? Fred. That's it. Oh, did so well to deny him. Well, they no longer have the ball. And a chance to whip it in here. And getting the ball forward. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Lisandro Martinez. Ryan Grafenberg. Untidy in possession. Mazraoui. He continues his run. Has eyes for goal. And blocked for now. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. But then the commentator's curse comes into play. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Pivotal moment defensively. Here's Berghaus. And that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. Well, it was a magical first half performance from Cristiano Ronaldo. No doubt about that, Stuart. Well, I thought he had a very good first 45 minutes. He scored a good goal, was a constant threat, and looked dangerous whenever he was on the ball. I'm sure he'd be the key player in the second half second half of this Champions League semi-final first leg underway <laughs> Diogo Dallo Nemanja Matic has it it's with Alex Tellez Lindelof Diogo Dallo on the ball Lindelof now Fred Diogo Dallo. Harry Maguire now. Fred. Diogo Dallo on the ball. Not showing good patience. Given away by Manchester United. Grafenberg. Well, they might be onto something. Real chance. Oh, yes! A goal! Exactly what they were looking for, and he's come up with it. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is.
Here's a change for Manchester United. So back in business, can Manchester United come up with an answer? Scott McTominay. Sancho. Here is Fred. Given away by Manchester United. 30 minutes to go then. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. Dusan Tadic. Here's Berghaus. Mazraoui. That's a nice looking ball. Not all that convincing defensively. Cristiano Ronaldo. Sancho. Moving the ball nicely. Trying to carve out the equaliser. Bruno Fernandes. Marvellous anticipation. And a chance to level it. And Rashford rattling it home. Well, let's take another look, and it's not good enough defensively. They're slow to react, don't get tight enough, and don't deal with the situation. And there's the outcome. Well, it has taken a Herculean effort for them to get back to level pegging under these trying circumstances. Jadon Sancho. Bruno Fernandes. Can they find a gap in the defence? Oh, he's given the ball away. A super tackle and they've won possession. More than decent this from United. But ultimately, up a cul-de-sac. Mali prevented it from going over the line. Manchester United on the front foot in the closing moments. Can well, he didn't miss by an awful lot. And the substitution will occur now. Kudus. And the ball with Alea. Plenty of options. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. And just five minutes remaining. And still on the lookout for the goal that could be so important at this juncture. Well, United had the ball, but not anymore. Dusan Tadic. Now with Alaire. Ajax being afforded too much space here. Across the byline, a goal kick as a result. Good tackle. And there's the final whistle. A thoroughly entertaining semi-final first leg. And I must say, Stuart, it bodes well for the return match. Yeah, fantastic first 90 minutes, wasn't it? Exactly what you want to see at this stage of the competition. Let's just hope they can replicate that in the reverse fixture. Well, no getting away from it. The real catalyst for his side tonight, Cristiano Ronaldo. Well, he certainly had some quiet spells in the game, but take nothing away from him. That was a really good goal and key to the result.